Next we're going to talk about the record menu and possible recording issues or hard drive issues. So when you first power up the unit, there are a couple of customers. Whenever a unit leaves from our factory, we typically install the hard drives into the machines. There are a couple of distributors though that do like to buy no drive machines and install their own drives or sell them as no drive machines and the dealer integrator installs their own drives. Now the one thing that's very important with the Paramount is that when you're installing your own drive, you need to make sure that the drive is formatted. If the drive is not formatted, you will not be able to record. The drive just sits there until it's formatted to the system preferences. So a lot of things that usually or typically happen is, or a complaint is, that they weren't notified when they first powered up the machine that the drive wasn't formatted. But in essence, you are actually given a, a, a warning. It just pops up and then it will disappear. So if it, person or if an installer dealer integrator goes to the site they plug in the machine they walk away to do something else whether it's a camera wiring or whatever else um, if they walk away and they miss the error message as you see it popped up the error message for the hard drive and then the network disconnect now if you let it go for a little bit the mess message will disappear which gets back to my point that if someone walks away or turns their head for a slight second they miss the beeping and the error message now they have no idea that they have to format the drive so we have gotten calls before where they call up and they say hey listen you know there's supposed to be a dot these things are set up to record straight out of the box on continuous record I don't see my record dot you know, uh, symbolizing that my machine's recording up in the top right-hand corner. What can be going on? Or they'll call up and say they're trying to do a playback and it says no, no data. Um, so one way to combat this and to make sure or to troubleshoot if you're running into this issue is go to the Start button, Settings, and then go to your disk menu. So when you have a hard drive that's installed into the machine but not formatted, you're going to see this little exclamation point with status unavailable. That means that your drive is installed, it's reading it, it's giving you all the information, but it's not formatted. So until you see a green circle with a check mark, the drive is in the machine, but not formatted and will not record. So again, this goes to sh um, just for anyone that's installing their own drives. Always remember to make sure and format the drives. So when you get to the screen, if you do install your own drives, you come here and you simply hit the format button. It'll ask you, are you sure you want to format disk one? Go ahead and hit OK. It'll run through. And then once it's done formatting, you'll now have that green circle with the check telling you that the status is RW for rewrite. And it will start to record. And then the record period will always tell you the span of retention time you have on your hard disk that's available in the machine. Um, it'll tell you the full capacity of the drive and free space. Now just to cover the free space as well, so when you first plug in a machine for the very first time and you take a look at the screen, free space is going to have a number here. Eventually once that drive fills up and then it starts to re-record first in, first out, uh, free space is going to turn to zero. Another call we always get is why does my free space say zero? Does that mean I have no more hard drive space? Does that mean that I'm no longer recording? Basically what that's saying is because the drive is filled up and now is doing first in, first out and rewriting the oldest with the newest information, technically there's no free space on the drive. The it's filled but it's rewriting itself. So again, it is still working. There is just zero free space technically because it's rewriting itself. If you needed to format the drive, simply come to the disk menu and hit format. And just like when it's brand new, this will format it, format the drive. It'll prompt you, are you sure? So you just can't hit it and it'll delete. Once you choose yes, it'll wipe the drive clean completely. There's no way to delete just segments or files. It's all or nothing for security purposes. And the Paramount NVRs and DVRs also have the smart hard drive technology as well. So when you click on the disk and you go to the smart information, any drive or drives that you have connected will go ahead and run through the smart um, tests here. And you can go ahead and scroll through to make sure all the status is normal. So if you ever thought that there was an issue with the drive, you can come down to the smart information and take a look here as well.